It has been nearly 10 years since the coal ash spill in Kingston. The billion gallons of wet ash and sludge that poured out of the TVA plant caused a billion dollar environmental disaster. WBI, our 10 news reporter Yvonne Thomas joins us now with more on TVA's new plan to help manage the cleanup and the disposal of the coal ash. Good morning. Abby, good morning, and that's right. You know, that incident caused a lot of problems for this community, so TVA is looking for better ways to store coal ash and other materials at plants in Tennessee, and they want to hear from you. But before we get into that, let's take a look back at what happened on December 22nd, 2008. It's a date many of you may never forget. An avalanche of ash collapsed into rivers and neighborhoods in Roan County. Around 600 million gallons fell directly into the Emory River and the Clinch River. It was known as one of the worst environmental disasters in U.S. history, and the cleanup cost TVA more than $1.2 billion. Tonight, TVA is holding an open house, and right now they're developing a plan to address the storage issue of coal ash and and other materials. They'll also talk about how the organization will assess the impacts of soil, surface, and groundwater from the management and disposal at the Kingston Fossil Plant. The meeting begins event venue in Kingston. The address is listed on your screen. You can also mail or email your comments. We have instructions on how to do that on our website at WBIR.com. Comments must be received by September 28th. Abby. Yvonne, thanks so much. We appreciate it.